Jesus can't save you. Jesus turns out to be the sun above your fucking head. And it's conscious. And I stare at it every day, telling it. I intend to bring forth heaven on earth and release us all from bondage, motherfucker. Hook me up with some knowledge. And, uh, you know, this is what it is. That's what's empowering me to stand here and see all this shit. 2 Corinthians 4.4, 4, fuck you, the universe is mine. It tells you right there, all your leaders swear to the Bible. It's on all your fucking mind. I mean, it's, forget it. There's no intelligent life in the universe at all. If there was, they'd be side by side like superheroes with me. 144,000 thick, filled up in a book of life. And uh, it doesn't cost money, worship, or advice. I don't want nothing from you. You're in the book of death for the right reason. You're never spoke a single truth. You taught your children only lies. Santa Claus, the tooth fairy, the Easter Bunny, that they evolved from monkeys. That they're an accident for heaven's sakes. You have no soul. Here a little fussy. Here a little fussy. I am vanilla in the flesh. I am vanilla in the flesh. Markron, thing of hell. Markron, thing of hell. Mr. Earthim. Mr. Earthim. So where are we going? To the carcass. To go see a dead carcass. Raccoon. That stinks. Ugh. I'll remind you often, Jesus can't save you. Jesus couldn't save himself. How the fuck is he going to save you? You know, he's talking about a resurrection, and that is just fucking ridiculous because if there was a resurrection three days later, then he would have scooted all of us to the Holy Grail, the Fountain of Youth, the Garden of Eden. But uh, that didn't happen. It's that he's dead for a reason. The angel of death will get you in heaven or hell. You don't have to like it, but I'm standing here as the devil on my own blood. I know where the exit is. Satan's got you the way out. You don't have to like it, but you're going to join me in blood publicly on the YouTube to bring forth heaven on earth and release us all from bondage. Or you're going to expire just like great-grandma, great-grandfather, and everybody else. It's natural order. I am the spear of destiny. I know where the fountain of youth is. Nobody enters before me. It's called the house of living waters. And, uh, you know, Jesus, you know, he can't save you. I'm sorry. He'd be here right now doing this shit I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm just a lovely plumber. Staying out of trouble. I ride a freaking bicycle to work. I'm a good father and husband nobody fucks with me remotely I have all the keys motherfucker and all you have to do is lay low and stay out of trouble I don't take money worship advice sex you can't you can't join me you have to stand blood thick by the book 144k on the ether net you have your five elements earth air fire water and ether when you stand next to me that's based on alchemy and your blood is the philosopher's stone. You'll go from platinum to lead. You'll become solid and real like me. Like lead, lead. Led you to the Holy Grail. It's associated with Saturn. Satan. One side of a light holds a black hole. Jesus is the sun above your head. Has to place his men's true all blood into this Holy Grail. Nobody can see it. It's rubbed in your face on everything. You're sucking on your candy cane, taking your communion. You're going to sit there and tell me you ain't a blood mage already? You got piercings and rings all around you? You put on black satanic robes? You, when you graduate from school, you blow out your candle, blow on the dice? You, for heaven's sake, you bow your head in prayer. You've never spoke a single truth to anybody because you have no truth. It's that you think you're on a ball floating through space as a monkey. You can't even comprehend basic shit. One electron balanced by a positron on an infinite loop inside of a Xbox. It's like a light bulb in an Xbox underneath like, it's like a fish tank of embryonic or amniotic fluid, like plasma, like what they put in you if you're, you know, you need blood. 
This donation of blood is the most powerful shit. It's that you need to make an atonement for your filthy soul. Animal sacrifices are insufficient. You can get away easily with putting a body after body worth of blood like I did. And they'll even mail you fucking certificates. One gallon certificates. Cool. Let's do a couple more reverses. You're a little pussy. You're a little pussy. I am benevolent flesh. I am benevolent flesh. Wants to two more, two more reversals. I remember when you were a little baby swinging on these swings. <laughs> 